What's up, Bagley? Right. I have some disturbing news. You see, I've been thinking. Yeah, and your point? Well, I don't bloody think, do I? I'm a super intelligent AI with a constant connection to all human knowledge. I don't have thoughts. I have load times. But after everything I've been through, dying, seeing all those people whose brains Sky Larson scooped out and turned into AI, being reborn, it got me pondering the nature of my own existence like some kind of renaissance aristocrat who's grown tired of buggering the servants. I don't think I've always been software. Whoa, Bagley. Do you think you were a person? Like I said, disturbing. Since we visited that lab, I found a series of images buried in my operating system. I think they might be memories of some kind, but the images are corrupted, so I can't say. I think this must be what it's like not to know things, and I think I hate it. Fucking hell, Bags. Send us the images. Maybe we can help you remember. Well, if it'll set your mind at rest, I sent you the images. If you get me a clear visual of each location, I can composite it with the image from my OS and... Remember more of my past life.
Okay, you know, seriously, I don't mind it's easier just to make a list of the shit I those kind of kids. Yeah. Hi, can I talk to Bradley Larson? Oh, are you a friend of his? Oh, yeah. We rode together. Back in university. I see. Well, it's nice of you to visit, but I wouldn't expect much conversation. Mr Larson hasn't been able to say a word for well over a year now. His dementia reached stage seven long ago. But go on in. I'll give you some privacy. Zealand yesterday. The men's aid set a record time, easily defeating the Germans and the Dutch, who placed a distant second and third. The women's aid fought it out in a real tussle down the course. I'm sorry, Bags. I know you didn't expect things to be like this. I have to talk to him. Cast me to the telly. Listen, you don't know me, but I know you. I've done a lot of searching, and I do think I know you. You were a rower. You loved and were loved. You liked strawberries. You had a sister you trusted, and she hurt you. And I'm sorry. You deserve better. But nothing Sky did to you changes who you are. You lived a life that I never could. You're a good person, and I am someone else. This has been an illuminating conversation. Thank you, Bradley. I'm glad I finally met you. So long, Bradley.